Good morning, AHS. Today is January 15th and is a white day on your schedule. Happy birthday today to Anthony Gregg. Today for lunch we have homemade chicken and rice stew, biscuits, green beans, fruit, and low-fat milk. And remember, every day you can get the assorted wraps, entree salad, yogurt parfait, pretzel or sun butter and jelly sandwich, and fruit. Now to Matt and Jake with your sports. Today for sports we have a home swim meet against Holland Patton. It starts at 5 o'clock. And congratulations to the boys and girls varsity bowling team for defeating Shenangle Forks. Hey, Cassandra. Hey, Nicole. How's it going? Good. Good. Um, are you excited for the weekend coming up? Oh, my goodness, yes. That's exciting. Um, oh, is that the camera? Is that running? Uh, I think it's time for the book of the day. Oh, well, we have a guest on today's book of the day, um, Cassandra Birch. Um, okay, so today's book of the day is The Infinite Sea. How do you rid the earth of seven billion humans? Rid the humans of their humanity. Surviving the first four waves was nearly impossible. Now Cassie <laughs> Sullivan finds herself in a new world, a world in which the fundamental trust that binds us together is gone. As the fifth wave rolls across the landscape, Cassie, Ben, and Ringer are forced to confront the other's ultimate goal the extermination of the human race. Pick this up in the library today. Oh my gosh, that sounds really scary. Really? Yeah. Maybe we can read it sometime. Yeah, we should. Okay, catch you around. In today's segment of Oh, the Places You'll Go, feature the career of NHS graduate Chantel Titus, class of 1983. Chantel is a salon owner, hairstylist. Her advice, students sometimes get away from making goals that are realistic. If you want something, work hard to get it. Senior directories are now available during lunch bells and in the main office. Your senior directory includes senior superlatives, faculty favorites, yearbook dedication, senior quotes, memorable moments, and more. The full completed pink packet must be turned into Miss McCormick no later than January 30th. Late directories will not be accepted. There is a scholarship opportunity for any seniors who play baseball and softball on the Student Services webpage. The Binghamton Umpires Association, Andrew G. Greco, awards for, okay, we got to start over. Come join us for Poetry Cafe. You don't have to read if you are shy. Refreshments provided. When is it? Thursday, February 5th, right after school. We will go until 4 o'clock. Where? Room 1 in the high school. Do you have a favorite poem? I would say probably Robert Frost's The Road Not Taken, you know? Two roads diverge in a yellow wood, and sorry I could not travel both. And be one traveler, long I stood, and looked down one as far as I could, to where it bent in the undergrowth. It's that time again. What time is that? It's time for the snowball. Oh, I would love to go with you. Thanks for asking. Oh, oh okay, moving on. Um, this year's snowball will be held on January 24th from 7.30 to 10.30. Costs will be $5 per person or $10 per couple. Remember, this will be a semi-formal event. So girls should wear either a dress, a skirt and a blouse, or dress pants. Boys should wear a button-down shirt, tie, and dress pants and shoes. This is supposed to be special, so don't wear jeans or sneakers, please. A concession table will offer free punch and baked goods and will be selling bottled water and candy. Looking forward to see you there with Max. Looking forward to see you there. <laughs> There's a scholarship opportunity open for any seniors who play softball or baseball and available on the Student Services webpage. The Binghamton Umpire Association awards for $750 will be awarded to one baseball player and one softball player in the region. The deadline for this scholarship is March 1st. Thanks for watching. This is the NHS News. Have a great day.